Welcome to Spoken English 2020 course. The objective of this course is to teach you simple, useful, international standard spoken English in a very short time. This course has two parts. The first part is the 10 video lessons on English pronunciation that you are watching now. And the second part, the most important part, is the software, Spoken English 2020 software that teaches you 2,000 most useful sentences in proper English. The sentences are taken from 10 real-life situations, real conversation. If you know those sentences, you can say, I speak English. If you bought the software Spoken English for Engineers and Scientists, it will teach you verbal English necessary for technical communication. It teaches the correct pronunciations of over 8,000 scientific and engineering terms and their usage in meaningful sentences. All you have to do is just see, listen, and repeat, and you will become fluent in technical English. It is a 60-hour intensive course giving an overall view of all major science and engineering branches the minimum knowledge every science and engineering student must have. It will also introduce you to the current technologies and research being conducted at the industry. It gives you many ideas for projects and group discussions. In addition to that, it teaches you about technical presentations, group discussions, and job interviews. You should invest 60 hours of your time learning spoken English for engineers and scientists to go abroad for higher studies or to work in a multinational corporation and to be successful in your career. All right, let's concentrate on the first part now. English pronunciation course. That's my name, Dr. Seha. In this course, you learn Correct pronunciation of 3,000 useful English words. 2,000 of them are taken from essential vocabulary of English. And 1,000 are often mispronounced words. Students who want to learn English as a second language, quite often they mispronounce those 1,000 words. I have included them in this video course. You learn 60 pronunciation rules. Many of them are not written anywhere. You learn both American and British pronunciation. If there are any major differences, I'll point that out to you. You learn accent and syllable stress, proper accent. It's very important in English. Syllable stress is essential part of pronunciation. You learn all the sounds used in the English language. There are about 45 sounds in English. You learn all of them. There are certain sounds that are typical to English and may not exist in your language. So I'll show you the tricks how to make those sounds. The last lesson, lesson 10, I'll give you sufficient hints for effective communication so that when you speak, people are going to listen to you. They're going to understand everything that you say. Okay? English is a difficult language because it's a mixture of several languages and it's evolved over the time. There are as many rules as exceptions. So I researched for many years the problems faced by the students who want to learn English as a second language. I identified the problems and found very easy solutions to them. Okay, those problems are solved. I've made it very easy for you. All you have to do is just see the words, listen to how I say it, and repeat. That's all. Everything else is organized and built into this education system. Okay? All you have to do is see, listen, and repeat. Try it for 20 hours. You see how your pronunciation sounds. Let's start. English.
start ing high lish softer english okay not english 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 pronunciation 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 not pronunciation course to explain to you how important it is to learn listen carefully and repeat exactly let's take examples of these three words they look somewhat alike but their pronunciations are very different this one starts with fa phonics repeat after me everything you must repeat phonics this one starts with pho phonemes this one starts with pho phonetics repeat phonics phonemes phonetics this is how carefully you have to listen and repeat okay let's start with lesson one the sounds of a b and c a has five different sounds maybe even six the letter a say the letter first a not a not ye a a has a very common sound uh comes from here the sound uh 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 you have to get that sound right because this is the most common sound in english okay uh uh if you don't have that sound practice it uh not ah uh, not ah uh uh, uh uh a book anything in blue see that is a uh. a book that's a book not a book a book about it's in blue start with a uh sound and you see this b it's in red anything in red say that louder so that your pitch goes up and becomes longer that's called stressing you learn that in lesson 4 but for now just follow the color code blue uh, red loud about do you hear about is louder about not about a uh, about about sofa so fa so blue a uh, so red loud sofa it's not sofa sofa a at the end of an english words always pronounces a uh. there may be a few exceptions grandpa grandma etc a uh. All right. This sound "er" uh, is so common in English. It's got a name. It's called schwa. Schwa means "er" uh, sound. It's got a phonetic symbol, which you learn in lesson three. It's "er" uh, sound. "Er." Uh. Okay. A has another sound, just like the letter A. Able. Practice. Repeat after me. Able. Table. This word is underlined. That means many people mispronounce it. Mispronounce it as ta table, table. No, table, table. Page long a, aim. Repeat after me. Plain. Any short a sound. Any. Many. A sound. He has another sound. All. All. Salt. Bald. Mall. American English sound changes to more open r, all, salt, bald, mall, and British all, all. It's not the sound of a open r sound r r. Open the mouth bar two thirds and say r, not ah, not all, r arm. That's my arm. Car, car, par. Large, father, ah sound. Now there's an asterisk here. Any time there's an asterisk, that means British and American pronunciations could be different or spelling. In British English, there's a rule. If there's a vowel sound after r, you pronounce the r. If there's no vowel sound after the r, you make it silent. For example, that would be arm, my arm, car, pa. Repeat, large, father. It's a bit insulting. American English, American English. You always pronounce R. Okay, apple, a song. O A, 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 
open the mouth wide and say a apple. Double P is pronounced a single P. Double consonants are almost always pronounced a single consonant. Okay? Um, that's a rule. You should write it down. Double consonants are pronounced a single consonant. Except sometimes double C because it's got two sounds. Mass. A sound. Mass. Both in British and American English. It's mass, not mass. It's underlined, that means many people mispronounce as moss. No. Mass. This one. Class. In British English is plus. Quite often, A is pronounced as R in British, A in American English. Not always. I'll point out which words have A and R sounds American and British. This is class in American, class in British. An. At. As. It's pronounced as a only when you emphasize strong form. Normally people change the act to a sound. That's why it's in blue. Un. Say with me. Un. A. Us. This is how normally people say. Rarely they emphasize. Okay. Un. Please give me an apple. An apple. I'm sitting at the table. At the table. Us. As I was saying. Us. Some words has got two different sounds of a. A, a. Animal. A L at the end of a word is always pronounced as o, not l. Animal. Salad. Salad. Again. A, again. Or again. Both are correct. Against. Against. Both are correct. Repeat after me. Against. Against. You try. Blue. Uh. Double R pronounced a symbol. It's red. Loud. That's simple. Array. Not array. Array. Advice. You give me a piece of advice. Advice. It's the verb. Z sound. V louder. Uh. Start with uh. You both A's are pronounced as uh. A sound. That's Schwa sound. You have to get that right. Assistant, not assistant. Assistant. Ago, ago. Three days ago. Solar. Solar. Yes. It's not solar. Solar. Polar. Camera. It's slight uh, sound here or could be silent. Camera. Capital. Capital. Repeat exactly, otherwise you'll not get the pronunciation right. Try this. Ca -n -d. Canada. It's not Canada. Canada. Last A pronounces a. It's a rule. Cocoa. Cocoa powder that you put in the milk and drink. Cocoa. The tree from which cocoa comes is cacao. Cocoa. Coat. A silent. A silent here. There are certain words where, if it's used as noun, the sound of A is different. If it's used as verb, the sound changes. For example, this one. Attribute is the noun. Attribute. Attribute is the verb. Okay? So A has about six sounds. A. Most common sounds called schwa. To learn all these vowel sounds in lesson three for now just follow me and repeat. Uh, uh. A A O O A Okay? Go over this lesson many times, packed with information. B is easy because B has only two sounds. B or silent. Big. Repeat often. Big. Book. Why is it underlined? Many people mispronounce it. Book. No. It's book. Short book sound. Book. Baby. Brother. British. Brother. Bicycle. 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 Or bike. But. 
still soft. But, not but. You learned that in lesson 8, the sound of T. For now, just say but. Bus, bath, American, British, bath. Bread, B and R together, very close. Bread, breakfast. Yes, you heard that right. Breakfast. Breakfast, not breakfast. Break, long A. Break, breaks of the bicycle. Begin. Botany, botany, botany. Hobby, double B, pronounce a single B. That's the rule. Hobby, body. Bold, who's bold? Brave. Bow, bow and arrow. There's another word with the same spelling, called bow. Bending your head forward, bow. Bowl, throwing a ball. Bowling, bowl. Why is it underlined? Some people say bowl, that's wrong. This is bowl, it's got another meaning. Bowl of soup, a bowl of salad. Bowl, say bowl, not bowl. Bowl is a different word. This is bowl. Bowl means a part of the digestive system where excrement collects, okay? So it's not the same thing. Ball. Balloon, loo louder, balloon, bonnet, the cover of the engine of a car in British English. Americans call it hood, bonnet, a hood, boot, boots, tall shoes, boots. Boot could also be luggage compartment of a car. British English, Americans call it trunk. Bring, B and R, very close together, practice that, bring. The last NG is pronounced as mm, mm, that's a rule. Okay, not bring, bring, leave it at mm sound. Library, library. In American English, it's A R Y at the end is pronounced as a -ry. Library, okay. In British, this becomes hurry or simply re. Library or library, library, okay. American library, practice that. Lamb, be silent. There are words for be silent. Lamb, comb, comb your hair. Tomb, tomb, tomb on a grave. Dumb, it's not smart. Do not call a person dumb, it's not polite, okay? People who cannot speak are called speech impaired, not dumb. They may be very smart people. Learn correct usage. Climb, be silent. Doubt, be silent. Debt, be silent. Subtle, repeat. Subtle means not very obvious. You have to have genuine interest in learning English. You have to listen carefully. Did I say interest? No, I said interest. 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 This is how you have to say. Did I say carefully? No. Carefully. Fully. Carefully. Listen very carefully. Repeat loudly, that's the key. Just listening to me or anyone's lecture is not going to help you much. You have to copy that, you have to say that yourself, loud and clear, exactly the way I pronounce. Your pronunciation is going to be excellent. Practice many times. It's a foreign language for you, I assume. You have to practice. Just a month. Practice for a month. You see the change. You'll speak as good as I do. Lesson three, you learn all the sounds, all the phonetic symbols, all the letters, very quickly. Okay, for now, just follow me. C, C, see how I'm saying? I'm not saying C. C, all English letters are pronounced as up to down. C, D, E, A, B, all right? C has two sounds. C and s, 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 turn forward. K comes from here, k, between K and KH. K, k, k. Call, British, call. Please call him. Americans say it more open. Call, please call him. Okay? It's basically the same. But the sound you should focus on is k, k. It's 
not k call no it's not call it's between the two call come cloth piece of cloth the material clothes that you wear very different song cloth clothes oh closet where you put your clothes cover careful underline many people mispronounce it cover cover computer 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 this is how you have to say not computer computer cabin repeat every word after me comment not comment center c e c i and c y changes the sound to s okay the second sound uh, i learned that from a book called logic of english by denise eig wonderful book lots of logic built into there center british spelling is t r e instead of t e r and pronounced center circle yeah i changes to er sound circle circuit you silent not circuit or circuit circuit you silent recycle cycle price pencil gray gray means silent Pen so pencil child c h takes the sound of ch ch or s or s h okay or k k sound child child children children beach careful very long e beach ocean beach pitch chicken 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 Machine sound changes to S H because it's from French. Machine, machine, ache, k sound, headache, chaos, not chaos. Chore, daily work that you do it may not be very interesting, but you have to comb your hair, take the garbage out. Chore. Choir, choir, a group of people who sing. Classical, a L rule, remember, from lesson one. Classical, classical, muscle, see silent. Curtain, yes, it's not curtain. Normally A-I has long A sound, but here it's silent. Curtain, curtain on the windows. Certain, 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 not certain. Certain, certainly, repeat. Ocean, C sound changed to S-H. Exceptional word. Ocean. Sh. Tongue back. Sh. O. O. Shun. Ocean. Social. S sound. S A sound. You learn all the sounds later. In another chapter. But for now, just copy me. Social. Species. Species. Let's see. Sh. This one. Z. Species. Human species. Account. Account, k sound. Occur, a uh, cur. So this is blue, a uh, sound. Occur. Cc, cubic centimeter, or carbon copy. When you send email to cc and bcc, it's carbon copy and blind carbon copy. You should know that. The second c is pronounced louder. Cc. Any time you see an abbreviation acronym like that. The last one is pronounced the loudest. That's why it's in red. B.C. before Christ. Oh, I missed a few. Blue. Uh. Red. Loud. Accept. Here both C's are pronounced. They are consonants, but they have different sounds. The first one is K sound. The second one is S, S sound. Accept. Accept. Accent. I like your accent. Say that. Accent. Axis. Axis. This one. Suck. Success. Success. I wish you success. In lesson two, you're going to learn all the sounds of D, E, and F. And many sounds. Especially the sounds of D and F are difficult. You're going to learn that.